Ha 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 Okay. Well then. Fascinating. Something grabbable over here. Oi. Why is there blood? Oi. Murderer, 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 Beans. What the? Who are you? I do love their beans. Ah, red paint. No, not you. <laughs> not you too. Oh, hang on. Alrighty. I think that's it. What if I fall all the way down? Ah, yes. I see that. Don't, don't you think I don't see that? I see you, little happy face. Uh, I'm out of ideas. I'm just gonna go jump in. Alright, I am... I've tried. I've tried and I failed. Goodbye. Hello everyone, I'm Maxwell and welcome back to Simple Liminal. Now, time to pick off, uh, pick up last where we left off. What the hell do I do here? Ah, oh, more of this, more of this, more of this nonsense. Nothing's ever easy anymore, is it? an avalanche. Ah, simple enough, thankfully. Thankfully. Anyway, um, clouds, clouds in the sky. Endlessly high hallways. Oh, right. Torch. What's this? The human brain? Neuron mortality. Hmm. Ah, uh, yes. More of this nonsense. Chess? Hmm. Interesting. Attention. Dr. Pierce continues to input significant errors. I will interpret his basic ideas. Hello. My introductions what? are redundant. I am Bruh. a real doctor who went to doctor school. VR has never been a mistake. I can help you, but I also do not know how. Transmission ends. Bruh! Millions of these thingamajiggies. Millions of vending machines. Oh. I'll take one with me. What's this? Okay. Don't worry, I'll take you with you with me, Mr. Vending Machine. What's going on? Hello, name is my Pierce Dr. Glenn. To what? the Somnusculpt Welcome Experience, team of your care leader, patient years 10 development. Conditions struggle you whatever with? Professional invention. Edge science with cutting, a tomorrow can bright. And buts, no ifs, or look good. Radio, um, yep, okay. Whatever you say, Mr. Doctor, whoever you are, Pierce, Dr. Glenn, I'm taking this with me, mate. Huh? What if I forget to set the dream? Hmm. Chore 8, beep, 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 emergency X protocol. Can I actually press the button on this one? Oh, I can't press the button. Oh well. Alrighty, where are we? What time is it? 7 a.m.? Okay. Is everything the same? No light? Wasn't there light here before? Well, obviously this door's open. Relaxation room. 
Have I always come out of the same room? Sweet F. That room is open as well. Sweet D. Sweet D. Anyway, let's go to the relaxation suite. Ah, relaxing. Something to do with clouds and weather? What's going on here? What's going on, Mr. Hello. Doctor? My name is Dr. Glenn Pierce. This is a notification that you have reappeared on our monitoring system after a prolonged absence. Please continue to do whatever you did most recently and discontinue whatever you were doing immediately prior to that. Sure thing, Mr. Doctor. What are we doing? Oh, it's the other side. Okay. Alrighty, back to basics. Okay, thank goodness. Has that always been the same? Hmm. Okay. Okay. A blue can. Well, looks like I'm going through this hallway, or down it. Hmm. Okay, let's have a look at this house. Ah, yes. Fragile! Ooh, sorry about that, mate. Ooh, uh, shaking. over here. A little podium. A little podium. What if I go into it? Like, can I be giant? I'm a giant! I'm gonna make this house a little bit smaller, actually. Can I crouch to get underneath it? Okay, let me in. There we go. See, I'm not that small. I can actually get up on this ledge. Nothing. Okay. Fire extinguisher. What is this? What? I think I've got to make the house even bigger. Yep, I knew it. I knew it. I knew it, alright. Nah, I failed. Alright, let's just get up here, see what's to go. Alright, radio man. Oh, oh no. Whoa. Huh. Um, oh, oh, right, there's more. Okay. Okay, Mr. Radio Man, what do you want? Hello, my name is Dr. Glenn Pierce. In addition to continuing and discontinuing as mentioned earlier, please also disregard any unsettling experiences that you may have recently had. Everything should have now reverted to being soothing and therapeutic. If this is not the case, you may be receiving this message in error. Okay, Mr. Radio Man. Why is I like that? Alrighty. We have to get up there. Jenga?
I see, I see, I see. Don't worry, we made it. Okay, what's going on here? What are we doing? Can I just... I'm just... I knew it! I knew I could just jump through that. That's not glass. Whatever. I'm, oh, I'm so small now. Why'd I do that? Well, thank goodness I did that because now I can go through here. Okay, 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 okay. I see what you're doing, Mr. Game. Oh, what the hell is this place? Huh. Ooh. Okay, uh, yep. I want to jump and get over there. Okay, uh, speak to me, radio man. Hello, my name is Dr. Glenn Pierce, and I'd like to read you my favorite inspirational quote by me. The worst thing you can do is focus on negativity. It won't spare you from the cage of death, the pain of disease, the cruelty of time, the cold shell of human nature, or the eventual loss of everything you've ever held dear. Whatever you do, don't focus on that. Sure thing, Mr. Doctor. I just want to get over here, to be honest. But I can't. I can't get up there. Oh, well. This is so damn trippy. What the? Let's see what's over here. Bouncy castle. Bouncy castle. Was there anything else that I should know, know about? Anything else? No, that's it. Okay. What am I doing here? I am really short. Ah, I'm even smaller than before. Alrighty, we're going through. How small can I get, actually? I make this really small. Really small. <laughs> we are getting really small, though. We're gonna we're gonna start seeing atoms at this point. All right, we are gonna start seeing atoms. Oh my god. We are so damn small. Oh my lord. What? We are so damn small. Oh my god. I'm so small. <laughs> I'm so small! Everything is giant! I wanna get smaller. No. It won't allow it, it won't allow it. Okay. Oh, well, I know, I know exactly what to do there. Just have it facing the door. But it might be a bit too big, so. Hmm. 
I see, I see, I see. What's that? A little life jacket. Bro, I am so damn small. Oh my lord, I'm so small. Look. Look how fast I'm traveling. I'm traveling as fast as I can. And I am so small. <laughs> that was a giant ledge. No. No. Oh no, what have, what have I done? This is absurdly small. Okay. Now we do this right, all right? We're gonna do this right. All right, we're gonna do this the right way. No more lollygagging around here. No more lollygagging around. Perfectly balanced as all things should be. I was so small that took me forever just to walk over here. Across that and then to come to the door just to not be able to get through. Okay, we are progressing. All right, Doctor, what do you have to say? Hello, my name is Dr. Glenn Pierce, and I'd like to thank you for triggering every single one of our 823 emergency protocols. This will assist us greatly in improving the system for future patients. Congratulations. Anyway, you're now headed in the right direction, and we should be able to initiate the emergency huh? exit protocol shortly. I know, I know, I know. Put it like that. See, see. Yeah, that's good enough. I can reach that. Can I still reach it? No, I do not want to be. <laughs> I do not want to be as small as that, like that last time. For real, we'll make it a bit bigger. Get a little closer. Get behind and skadoosh. Oh no, I'm too big. Oh. I'm gonna have to get a bit smaller. I have to be at least like that small. Okay, let's do this right. Come here.
and just try and bounce that on top. That's fine. There we go. What if I just take this with me? Hey, it's chess. 5D chess, anyone? We are just gonna make ourselves normal size. Portals, I got portals with me. Oh wait, is there anything else in this room that I forgot? No, not this nonsense again. Let's go. Meeting on the Cardboards Lovers Association. The Cardboards Lovers Association. Okay. Got a picture of a kitty. Where's this white line going? Uh, yes, yes, yes. 3 a.m. again? Well then, that's different. Alright, time to go to and see what all this nonsense is about. Danger. Warning. Emergency exit protocol initiated. Please prepare to conclude your Somnasculpt experience in 10, 9, 8. Hmm? What happened? Error. Error logged by Orientation Protocol. Stand by for analysis. Again, that looks like real Error blood. Analysis complete. You are exhibiting signs consistent with an increase in fear, hopelessness, and frustration. This is inconceivable, as somnasculpt therapy is proven to correlate with a decrease in these emotions. If you say so. I don't feel that way, but if you say so. Hypothesis. Patient was improperly oriented. Conclusion. Impossible. Reformulating. Hmm. Am I going to circles? Improved hypothesis. Patient requires additional somnasculpt therapy. Conclusion. Emergency exit protocol cannot proceed. Emergency exit protocol has been emergency destroyed. Wake up. Hmm. Instruction, continue with Somnasculpt therapy indefinitely on an independent no basis, as all orientation resources have been exhausted. This concludes your standard orientation protocol. Goodbye. Huh? What? We are back at Sweet F. Alright, Sweet F. Okay, back to the normal ways we go. Okay, that has actually always been like that. What? What's going on here? Why am I hearing it here? Enough. All right, enough. Now, back to the, what we actually need to be, huh? No. No. I'm just gonna lead. Huh? What? The door's closed. Ah! Ah! What the? Huh? What? Okay. 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 You had your fun, mate. What? I'm hearing it. Enough. No. What? I wanted to explore! Oh, no! Huh? Huh? Okay, okay. N enough fun and games, mate. Enough fun and games. Where do I go from here? Okay, okay, okay. Here 
in we go. Okay, we made it out. Hello, my name is Dr. Glenn Pierce. Morning, Thank Glenn. You for completing the Somnusculpt Standard Orientation Protocol. Before you begin the first phase of therapy, I'd like to briefly describe the finite and fragile nature of the dream state. Fragile nature of the dream state? Okay. Huh? Whoa! Okay. Just gonna keep walking. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Interesting, mate. Interesting. Do I dare? I can't. Some random TV with an apple over there. Okay, okay. Huh. I like it, it's cool. Bit disorienting though, but um What exactly do I do here? Clever. All right, we're going through the wobbly wavy. Oh man, this is trippy. We are finding cracks in their armor. Of course, nothing is more challenging than the difficulty of changing perspective, of fundamentally altering your perceptions in a way that will enable you to face dire trial-by-fire scenarios with solutions that could not be found otherwise. Thank you, Doctor. What's over this way? Anything? No? Okay. Interesting. Back to normal. Alrighty. Was this always here? A giant stairway. Hey! Whoa! Okay. In the elevator we go. Okay, very funny, very funny. Next floor, oh, never mind. Carbon recycling, cardboard only. Well, that's actually plastic. So, um, someone's not doing their job. No trespassing, dead end. I doubt it, I doubt it. Perception not is reality is not reality. Hmm. Okay, I'm going to go through this way. You're saying this way, but it's a dead end. I have to go this way. Keep going. Huh? Oh, now it's this way. Well, let's just keep going. See where we go. Uh, nope. Ah, oh, 
no, not like exit eight. Okay, okay, I see what you're doing. Don't, don't tempt me. Don't tempt me. Okay. Don't even. What? I failed. How do I know which way is the exit? Exit hallway eight. Bruh, how do I know which way to go? This way? <laughs> Don't ever have to look that way. This way. What? No. Hang on. Nothing. Nothing. See, nothing's there. How did, I, how did I fail that? Look, nothing's here. Nothing's here, bro. Why is that a fail? Never mind. Huh? No. Okay, okay. This is some baloney. Um, I don't know where to go from here. Why is that a fail? Why is that a fail? Why are you telling me to go this way? Perception is not reality. That's some bullshit. I don't know what I'm doing to make it go <laughs> keep going. That's some bullshit. All right, I don't like that. That's some bullshit. <sighs> Whatever. What is this nonsense? <laughs> something up there? All right, what's going on, doctor? Finally, while we respect the unique progress of every patient, you must understand that it is possible to completely exhaust your supply of dreams, thereby entering a state in which you will not be able to wake up, even with the help of triggering mechanisms. Triggering, triggering. All right, that's all baloney. Can. It's up there, but how do I get that? We got it. We got it. Now. Huh? What the hell? Okay, um, sure. What's all this nonsense about? Huh? What the? Huh? Which way do we go? Okay, uh, I'm just gonna go this way. 
Okay, I'm not gonna go that way. I'm gonna go this way. Enough of your nonsense. Hmm. Well, I I guess I should expect anything at this point. I'm following it. Does it lead anywhere? Straight ahead? This way? This way? Alright, we made it out of there. Please listen carefully for the sound of an alarm clock, which will automatically play if you are approaching a destabilizing dream weight. I guess. Huh. What? Bruh. What? Even these chairs too? Bruh. Okay. Okay. We're outside. Woohoo! We made it! Where was that? The mud? <sighs> I should've- I should've known. I should have known. Right, okay. Okay, mister. What's this? What's this? A doorway. Welcome. Oh, I want to go in the doorway, but anyway. We'll go to the room. So much shenanigans. Every level is loading right now. Huh. Anything else here? Unusual. It appears you have entered the Sonasculp diagnostic framework. Patients do not have access to this dream. What? Oh, uh, how do, how do I put this back? Sorry, uh... Ooh. Oh. Diagnostic warning. Unrealistic use of dream objects may result in dream integrity fail state state states. Yeah. Huh? What? Was that always like that? Any more I could play around with? Um, okay. Okay, now we go outside. Yeah, here we go. We're going through here, no? Closed. Come back later. Why? I hear music in there. There's music here. I need to find like a little door or something that I have to... Hmm? Oh, 
What if I go through the door? Whoa! 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 I just broke reality. Ah, it's, it's bright. What's going on here? Huh? What's going on? Where am I? What is this? What is this place? All right, what's in here? Ooh, very fancy. I like it. Bruh. Amazing. Amazing. Oh, I fell off. Oh. No. Hey. Oh. Where am I? Okay. I'm taking this box with me. Okay, I guess I'm not. Doctor, what's happening? Hello. My name is Dr. Glenn Pierce, and many years ago, I had a dream. I found myself in a place where I understood that each of us begins as nothing, where everything I perceived was shaped by seeing it exactly the way I wanted to. White space. Where am I, Mr. Doctor? What is this place? Strange stuff is happening in this dream. Ow. What in the name is going on? Well, I guess I just have to keep going. In we go. We can't go this way? Baloney. Erase me. Re what? Relaxiat. Minerals. Female toads. What? Hey! Huh? Well, that still works the same. Not an exit. Are you sure about that? Are you sure about that? All right, Mr. Man, what do I do here? A cup. Aha! Uh -huh. Where do I go? Oh, okay. I go over here. What if I just walk off into oblivion? What's this? Bruh, this is this is some trippy stuff. Okay, uh we're going in through this door now. I can't reach it. No, I can't reach it. Wow. 
What? 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 But in white space, I also faced the greatest challenge I could imagine. Because with a lifetime of life itself behind me, and all of the weight that it carried, I realized that seeing things the way I wanted to was not as easy as it used to be. Thanks, Doctor. Ah, switch. Oh, well. That turned everything off. That music's still playing, so something is happening. Oh, oh, I was supposed to... Okay. I knew it wasn't over. Right, okay. <laughs> Why? Why? <laughs> Bruh. This is... We need more games like this, for real. This is so trippy. Ooh. Okay, I'll go through this door. Oh, it's the same place. Okay, uh... Okay... Something is not right here. I got stuck behind that for a minute. Okay. Very nice. This looks this all looks fantastic. What's happening, Doctor? You're well beyond dreaming now, and further out than anyone has ever come back from. But we hope that you won't get discouraged. After all, if this is a place of pure perspective, isn't it also a place where a different point of view could make anything possible? Of course, Isn't Doctor. That why you came here? Well, yeah, of course. I gotta check them. Make sure that these isn't. Oh, oh I see what you. Oh, very nice, very nice. I see, I see. The first one should be fine. I need to get to the door, and the only way I can get to the door is making sure these are on the tile. Okay. What's through this door? That is not a door. Any other blocks? No blocks? What if I put it through the door? It's through the door! But how? What? Okay, okay, okay. 
I see what you're doing with your shenanigans. There we go, we can now get up. We made it! After restarting, but we made it! Whoa. What in the name? What if I fall down it? Oh, I can. Maybe I'll just go down it and see what happens. And we found the door. What in the name? Well, we're just going to walk towards the end. And see where this nonsense takes us. Oh. Over here. What time is it? What time is it? It's literally 7.30. Oh, okay then. What the? Well, 8 o'clock then. What? We're still falling. We were still falling. What are you going to do now? Loading sign? Do something different with your shenanigans? Something different? Oh, nothing. Okay. Load away then. Load away. What's that? 8 a.m. What am I doing here again? Why am I here? Hello, my name is Dr. Glenn Pierce. Can I get out of here? Now, you may have realized that all of this has happened exactly the way it was supposed to. You see, everyone who comes to the Institute does so because they feel that they are no longer in control of something important to them. Often than not, the problem is not that the problems we face can't be solved. The problem is that we become so afraid of failure that we refuse to see our problems from a new perspective. And so, mm. we do the same things again and again and again. And therein, of course, we find exactly the failure we were looking for. Oh. Very nice, Doctor. Very nice. In a few minutes. 
minutes, you'll be back in the real world. Some part of you will say that none of this was real. So huh? how could it have really meant anything? But just like the power of perspective itself, it will have been as real as you believed it to be. All you've got to do is wait up. Okay. Whoa. Well then, that is actually... Is that it? Damn, man, that's something else. That is something else. Well, ladies and gentlemen, that is super luminal. I like it. Good game. But can I skip this damn end credits? Is that it? Is that it? Okay. Anyway, thank you so much for watching, and I'll catch you on the next game. Bye.